one is exactly what we're doing here. Uh, create a world-class, and we don't use that term lightly, create a world-class safety and training program. It's really time for us to begin to think about how, what our own workforce looks like, how they learn, how they're trained, and we clearly need to move to a more digital style, a faster style, a more interactive style. I think beyond that, we certainly talk a lot about market growth, and we don't shy away from talking about market growth, and it's market growth in all segments, residential, commercial, industrial, auto gas, forklift, and agriculture. So each of our segments are tasked and challenged to grow uh, both in customers and applications through the year. So the third part of that that's really important is to change how we message, to now begin to have a more provocative style, if you will, of messaging and really to be aware that a lot of people want us to talk about the environmental benefits of propane, uh, which is a beautiful thing, as I told the group this morning, because the luxury of chemistry and science, propane was dealt a good card there. And as we begin to marry technology with the applications, with science, we have a strong argument when the conversation goes to climate change and how can a clean fuel like propane be a part of the solution going forward. If you kind of tie it all together with the fourth piece then, it's really to think about how PERC can holistically serve the whole industry better. And it probably comes more out in the form of workforce outreach. How do we really create an image for this industry so youthful workers want to come, perhaps people who lived in the city and didn't have experience with propane, they're attracted because they see, um, one, how our industry works with each other. They see the benefits of our industry to the customers. They see the benefits of our industry to the environment. So to tie all that together under a very broad umbrella of workforce outreach. Daunting task, I think the staff that we have in place is ready to do that. We're working so well with NPGA and the state executives that we're only, we, we know we'll have success in 2020.